start recording. The one thing uh, that, uh, the reason I, I, as I stood up and prayed against fear is that I, I've got everything set out. It's on, I love it when God does this. You've got everything set out. You know exactly what you're going to do. You know exactly what you want to share. On. And then suddenly God says, okay, I will change you. We need to address this matter. And it's been coming over a while, and uh, the, the biggest thing that's not encroaching on this church only, but on everybody, fear. Mm -hmm. And if any of us say that we do not fear at times, then we're liars. Mm -hmm. Because fear grips everybody at some time or other. <clears throat> now, uh, a lot of people have said... Um, when they're going through certain things, they're going through a Job situation. You know, I'm innocent. I'm, I'm, I'm just so innocent. And like Job, I'm upright and righteous in all that I do. And on all this before uh, Job, and, and he'd done nothing wrong. The biggest institute of everything that comes upon us is fear. Fear is believing that which you cannot see will come to pass. Mm -hmm. Faith is believing that which you cannot see will come to pass. Mm -hmm. Don't they sound similar? Mm -hmm. The reason is, they are. But one works in Satan's kingdom, and one works in God's kingdom. And God wants you to look in faith. Not at what you can't see, but what you, you can see spiritually. And this is why he said to um, uh, Abraham, what can you see? Oh, I can see this mountain, that mountain. Well, all that you can see, you can have. So God wants to encourage us to see a brighter future. And it's not orange, <laughs> it's gold. Praise <laughs> God. <laughs> and the brighter future <laughs> is in his hands. Mm. What we've got to do is be reassured by the Holy Spirit when you're in, in the presence of God. This is the importance of worship. It gets you into the presence of God. And while you're there, you can say, Lord, I've got all this hassle and I'm not coping very well. And he'll put his arm around you and he'll hold you. And say, you can do this. I, there's nothing I haven't asked you to do that you can't do.